Hello everyone, this is the microphone with a quick guide on how to downgrade the Transformer Prime and hopefully get rooted and also install custom ROMs. Um, right now I'm running Build Tools Prime version um, tw point 0.21 um, B1 as you can see right here. Let me show you. Um, right there you can see that's the version i'm running right now it took me a pretty long time to get it done but i actually did i had to do a lot of um reading and a lot of search so this is the reason why i'm doing this video um so before we even start there's a lot of things you have to get done first um and one of them you want to go on to um develop him development option over here um once you're there um hit okay to this um enable usb debugging up here uh, make sure that's checked hit okay to that um go on to sorry go on to um account sync and sync over there and then make sure that's unchecked just one test up if this if this does not work first time you do it you might want to do a factory reset and this is gonna help you the same way it did when I was trying it I tried so many times I was getting tired already that was my last option and after I did that it did work um, so for you to do that you go into settings um, and go on to backup and reset and do a factory right here factory data reset it will erase everything on the tablet and um, just hit reset. Once you're done with that, you're ready to go onto the computer side and get all the programs you need. Um, first, you're gonna need to download the firmware um, you want to download onto. And this will only work if you're running um, the latest update which is um, if it's either the US or the WW version um, I think I'll be able to do it from here um, if not I can just get back onto the stock just to show you how it's done um, so uh, once you're done that um, let's get started all the links are gonna be down in the description um, if you have any questions, just ask me and all the stuff. Right now, we're gonna move on to the computer um, to get this baby going. All right. Well, guys, once we completed the previous steps, you're gonna need to have your transformer prime connected to your computer. Um, once you've done you've done that, you're gonna need to install the drivers onto your computer for the transformer prime. I'm gonna have a link in the description on how to do that. Once you do that, you're gonna need the um, two things the viper mode prime tool to do the process of the downgrade and also the version you want to um, downgrade to i'm going to have the description on both of these files once you have them unzip them and run them um the first thing you're going to need to unzip is your update once it's going to look like this open it go ahead and open it um and it's going to have this two files in there um the blob and the that folder right there the only thing you're gonna need is the blob file this you can delete it once you unzip it and this you're gonna have to move it onto the root of your transformer prime go to computer once we are here um go to the root of your transformer prime something really important you have to have it on the internal storage no one not on the sd card or anything else once you go there put it right there on the root of your um, transformer prime as you can see it right here um, 
pass that file once you have that done um, you can exit out of that and go ahead and open the tool wherever you um, wherever you extracted it I extracted it over here so you go there once you have that done open it and it's gonna look like this um, let me see if I can get it better hold on to that sorry um, it's going to look like this um, once here it tells you one to downgrade two to rule only method prime um, jada jada whatever that is and then some other stuff here um, so the first one we want to work with is number one so just press number one and then enter once you do that it's gonna take you here press any key to continue hit enter and then the next step as well enter uh, once you do that it's gonna locate your file and it's gonna do everything for you it might reboot several times one or two times um, once you've done that um, it's gonna boot um, in one and once it does boot it's gonna have like a little loading line here when it reboots and just be patient wait until that's done when you're on this process it's gonna tell you um, that once it reboots it's gonna take three to ten minutes to install the um, the older framework um, once it's done that you are on um, point 15 framework and once you're there you're ready to to root your tablet there's another version that it's a little bit more um, easier to root with I haven't tried with this one um, let me see but I think it does work if not I'm gonna have another Viper mode prime tool on the description it's gonna look like this um, once you open it okay sorry um, let's close this one up it's going to look like this go ahead run it and once you run it it's gonna be red instead of green and this one was the one that I used to root once I downgrade it um, to do that all you have to do Wait, sorry, give me a second. Um, all you have to do is click one and proceed to the um, a step. It's gonna do everything by itself. Just continue on the screen and it's gonna be rooted. Once you're rooted, and if you have, to, if you want to unlock the bootload, this is gonna do it. Go here and put um, choose option five. Once you've done that, it's gonna be installed on your computer. Um, your transformer prime and once you've done that you just go here into your app train sorry onto your apps and once you're here you just locate the um the unlock app and once you follow through and your transformer prime reboots and it tells you up here in little white letters that um it's been unlocked you are ready to go here again to the computer um, and do the process again well it's gonna stay there and once you are unlocked and other stuff it's gonna tell you to press a key to flash the clockwork mode recovery and once you have that done to access clockwork mode recovery I recommend you not to be connected um, to have your transformer prime connected to your PC once you've done that all you have to do is press um, Let me see if I can show this more stay um, You can go ahead press power button and volume down together Once you hear the don't release them once the next screen comes up and the letters are up, release them and press button up. And that's gonna take it to Clockwork Mode Recovery. 
Once we're here, you can install basically any ROM you want. There's a lot of websites that have ROMs that you can download. Right now, as I told you, I'm running um, Bluetooth Prime. And once you're here, this is how Clockwork Mode is gonna look like. If you want to update Clockwork Mode, I'm gonna show you right now how to do so. But once you're here, if you want to flash any other ROM, um, what I recommend you first is to wipe and reset um sorry to wipe and reset your transformer prime just hit enter on that go down and hit yes once you have that done um you're ready to install it from um from sd card once you're here um, hit that same option that is right there choose zip from SD card enter and Once you're here you have to lock key wherever you put um, The RAM I recommend you right now. I'm gonna show you where to put it. Let's go into my computer and I can show you um, Once you have it there locate it on my case is right there hit enter and just hit yes install and the transformer prime is going to guide you on how to install the rest let's reboot my transformer prime so that i can show you where you could put um the unsure rom you have you want to install um so for that all you have to do is plug your transformer prime to your pc right there once is recognized by your computer um, go to the start menu here computer well sorry computer and let's wait until my transform prime boots up so that um, the USB can be placed there okay so you go here and at the same place where you put it the block file on the root of your transformer prime you just put the um the rom there and once you have it there it's easy to install um so that's it guys that was just a quick tutorial on how to root and how to unlock the bootloader so that you can install custom roms and all the stuff let me show you how to um upgrade your um, clockwork mode version so once you're done with that you just go to the play store and search for um, ROM manager search for ROM manager okay let's go here let's type ROM, ROM manager so once we have it here just click on it Go ahead and install the free version. Oh, I didn't have it installed. I don't know, just for my Well, I didn't need it after I flashed it to this um, version. So go ahead and download it. Okay, that's taking kind of long. Well, no. no, no. Open it. Once you're here, all you have to do is uh, flash clockwork more recovery and it's gonna update by itself. Once you have that done, you can go ahead and install any ROM you want and do whatever the hell you please with your um, transformer prime just you know it's rooted well of course it's rooted because i have built to virtuals prime on it i have super user right here um as you can see install my transformer prime one well, everything um i recommend this rom for personal preferences um everything works really great just like stock um transformer framework and well this one doesn't have as much 
box as the other ones. Um, there's a lot of ROMs that have a lot of box and things that are missing. So uh, for me, this one is the more, the most complete one and all the stuff. And I'm just gonna wait until all the other ones are like updated. So that's it for downgrading and all the stuff. I'm gonna put a link on the description for you to see um, a tutorial. Um, on words and all the stuff if you are better at seeing things like that or something else I don't know and that way you have a better idea on how this is done um, this helped me a lot this is why I took the time to do this video I hope you enjoy it and I hope it works for you so as you know subscribe um, thumbs up and well, I hope you enjoy it. Thank you. Bye.